Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Mega Mind, and in today's video, we are learning how to program an ESP32 cam using an Arduino Uno. Since the ESP32 cam doesn't come with a USB port, most people think you will need a TTL converter. But I am here to show you a cost-effective alternative. Let's jump straight into setting up the circuit. Alright, first we will set up the ESP32 cam on the breadboard. Place the ESP32 cam securely on the breadboard making sure it sits properly. Next connect the wire to the 5V pin of the ESP32 cam, we will be powering it directly through Arduino. Now connect the wire to the GND pin of ESP32 cam. For serial communication we will be connecting TX pin of ESP32 cam to the TX pin of Arduino Uno and RX pin of ESP32 cam to the RX pin of Arduino Uno. After that, sort the GND pin of the ESP32 cam to the GPIO pin. This will put the ESP32 cam into programming mode. Now let's move over the Arduino. Here we will connect 5V pin of ESP32 cam to the 5V pin of Arduino Uno and the ground pin to ground. Now we will sort reset pin and ground pin of Arduino. Our circuit is good to go, let's move ahead to the programming part. First of all you need to install ESP32 library on your Arduino ID. For this I have provided a link in the description, you can just simply copy and paste it in your additional board manager URL. Now go to the board manager setting, search for ESP32. As you can see I have already installed it so it is showing remove. You will find a button to install it, just simply click it and it will get automatically installed. Go to file section, click example, underneath you will find ESP32. Move your pointer to ESP32, you will find a bunch of example codes, then click camera. You will get your example code here. Now go to tool section and select your board. You need to select ESP32 Arduino underneath ESP32 over module. Now uncomment the model you are using. As I am using AI Thinker module, I will uncomment the AI Thinker. Provide your Wi-Fi password and name in this section. Once uploading is done, open serial monitor and you will need to restart your ESP32 cam. For that you can just simply press the reset button underneath the ESP32 cam. After that it will provide you with the IP address. Just copy it and paste in your browser and you are good to go. You will find a dashboard that will showing your ESP32 cam. As you can see our ESP32 cam is streaming properly. You will get a lot of options on the dashboard. You can control resolutions, modes and also the LED on the ESP32 cam. You can select the resolution low if you want to transmit your video to a long distance without delay. In many projects you can just simply paste your IP address and your camera will work there. If you found this tutorial helpful please give it a like, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification. Stay tuned for next videos.